Yeah, hi, my name is Fred. Um, I live in Connecticut, and I've been a Republican just about all my life. The Republican Party has really, um, you know, spoken to to the way I view things, which is um, believing in uh, being self-reliant, believing in the rule of law. Um, you know, believing the government does need to step in, but it needs to be be done carefully and in, in a limited way. One of my main concerns with Trump is just the way he, his demeanor and his temperament. And that has been so disastrous to having a constructive conversation, the constructive conversations that we need to solve the, the problems in this country. It's gonna end up in the long term, I believe, hurting the Republican Party. It's gonna be inflaming the, uh, the extremists in the country, which, which is just gonna make things worse. Trump is almost the opposite of what we need in the leader of this country. So, you know, they say good leaders should be good listeners. And Trump is not a good listener. <laughs> I, I get the impression that Mr. Trump is primarily in this for himself and his family. And many of the things he's done are can be viewed as supporting that. <laughs> I think Trump is a disaster for the country. And um, just about anybody would be better. <laughs> so I hope that um, Joe Biden becomes a moderate and uh, brings people in from all sides to lead the country. I hope when he's elected, he realizes he's got to um, go to the middle and, and lead this country from a moderate point of view and do everything he can to reunite people. So one thing I'd like to say to, to current Republicans, if you are more moderate, um, there has been a tendency for, for Republicans to leave the party because they're so frustrated by the situation and to give up give up their hands. And, um, you know, my, I hope that enough people stay in the party to see us through this very dark period and bring us through to, uh, to the more traditional um, values and uh, functioning of the Republican Party. And there, there are still many moderate Republicans out there. So don't give up because um, if you do, then things will just get worse without you.